Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Stu. Today we're going to talk about Matthew Kachuk's hit on Mark Shifley during the playoffs and all the other times he's been dirty. The truth. Okay, so before I start this video, I gotta first of all say that I know I have some fans that aren't hockey fans. And I have some viewers that pretty much know like nothing about hockey and aren't interested in it. So I just wanted to let you know that maybe for the next like few weeks or maybe like a month or so, a lot of my videos I'm going to be making are going to be centered around hockey considering, you know, the playoffs just started and everything. So uh, yeah, just letting you guys know for that, considering I would think you guys want to know. So yeah, if you're not interested in hockey, maybe, I don't know, you can watch the videos or maybe you don't have to. But um... If you don't know about hockey and you want to learn more, you can watch it. And maybe if you already know about hockey, you can still watch it. Pretty much anybody can watch it. But what I'm saying is, uh, pretty much since the playoffs are going on right now for the NHL, I'm going to be more, in a, more in of a hockey mindset. Meaning that a lot of my videos are going to be centered around hockey rather than my other videos, which is just on whatever. So, uh, other than that, let's get into the video. So... The player I'm going to be talking about today is a player that plays on the Calgary Flames named Matthew Kachuk. And not Brady Kachuk, not Keith Kachuk. I'm talking about Matthew Kachuk, the one, like I said, for the Calgary Flames, number 19. And like I said in the intro, he is a very dirty player. At least that's what most people think. Like, for example, he's in the news right now and he's in the media because of this play that he made against the Winnipeg Jets since they're the rivals in the qualifying rounds. And I'm going to play it right now. One on two for Mark Chifley. And he'll duck a check and play it around because, oh, and Chifley's in trouble. Mark Chifley is in some difficulty as he ducked a check from... So, uh, yeah, as you can see, that's a very controversial and somewhat dirty hit that most people are thinking about considering it, like, injured him and I believe is one of his legs. And a lot of people are putting him in fire for that. It doesn't matter whether you think he's innocent or he's guilty. He loves the spotlight. So that's one of the things. And Brady Kachuk is somewhat all right. Like he's not annoying like his brother. But uh, yeah, Brady Kachuk, it's not his first time ever like getting into a scrap with anyone. He's, he's one of those guys like Evander Kane or Ryan Reeves, where he just always gets under your skin. And that's the whole point of the team. So like, for example, there's that one play I just showed that happened last night, I think, against Winnipeg, and obviously he's under a lot of fire, like I said. The head coach of the Winnipeg Jets said that it was a disgusting play, and a very dirty play. So there's some people that are defending him, some people that aren't, and me personally, I'm kind of in the middle. I don't know for sure. I do know I hate Matthew Kachuk, because... Here I'll show you another clip right now, that's where there was this huge brawl going on in Arizona. And I actually kind of like this clip considering the goaltender for the Coyotes, Darcy Kemper, took him in a headlock and threw him down. And then I'm also going to have a clip right here where it's going to be uh, him versus Zach Cassian when they were playing in the exhibition games, meaning the games that basically meant nothing, it was just rivalries. And as you can see by this play, uh, Zach Cassian doesn't like it, so Zach Cassian of the Oilers takes a stick and he chops Matthew Kachuk in the back. Or not Matthew Kachuk, Brady, or Matthew Kachuk, I don't know what I'm saying. Yes, Matthew Kachuk. So, if you ask me, he got what he deserved. And there, there's just so many more times where he's gotten in, like, fights and he's had problems with people. And pretty much me, I'll enjoy any opportunity that I have where I see him getting... Uh, karma going to him because like I said like I don't like Ryan Reeves I don't like Evander Kane I don't like Matthew Kachuk and the, the other Kachuk ironically had this fight against P.K. Subban of the Devils where he like slammed him but Matthew Kachuk he's more of that player where it's like he'll hit you dirty and then when you try to get him back he'll pretend like he didn't do anything wrong and then the refs will fall for his tricks or he'll like start trash talking or he'll like whack you and then when you whack him back you're the one that gets the penalty for it. So he's that kind of player. And I'm, I'm sure Flames fans don't hate him considering he 
gives them like a bunch of power plays and everything. But if you're not a Flames fan, you pretty much hate Matthew Chuck any day of the week. So, I, I mean, Matthew Chuck, he's somewhat experienced. Like, there was that game he in the All-Star game where he was in St. Louis and he like wore the Cardinals jersey and he got all of like, St. Louis on the side. But, like, let's say you're an Oilers fan or you're a Jets fan, you hate Matthew Chuck right now. Especially since like, there's, like, the Battle of Alberta. And if you ever watch clips of the Battle of Alberta, which is basically Edmonton versus Calgary, and they call it the Battle of Alberta because they're huge rivals, so they'll get into a lot of fights and everything. But yeah, if you ever do watch that rivalry, and you do watch those games, you'll notice that it's mostly Matthew Kachuk that's getting into the battles with everyone. Now, there was that cool goalie fight that happened at one of the games where it was, I think, Mike Smith versus Cam Talbot or David Riddick. But, um, essentially, it's just, like I said, anytime there's a fight going on between the Flames and someone on, or someone else, you got like a 75% chance it's going to be Matthew Chuck. And I don't remember who, but I saw another interview for it on Instagram, and it was um, one guy defending Matthew Kachuk, and he kind of flamed him. But at the same time, he was kind of like defending him against a penalty, and he said, with all known respect to Matthew Kachuk, he's not that kind of player that's able to use his foot to injure someone. Because people are saying that he like cut Mark Shifley with a skate, but... Uh, I don't remember who it was, but he was basically saying Matthew Kachuk isn't talented enough to know how to injure with his foot and a skate. Which kind of roasted him, but at the same time, kind of defended him. And like I said, I'm not in the middle. I do hate him, but I'm not going to say he's guilty just because I hate him. But uh, if you are a hockey fan, maybe leave another comment about it. Uh, again, I'm going to leave clips of pretty much every fight that I mentioned where he injured Mark Shifley number one and then like his fights in the Battle of Alberta or him against Zach Cassian but uh yeah so other than that like I said I'm gonna be making a lot of NHL videos like yesterday I made my montage and I, I spent a long time on it so I hope you guys enjoyed that and I mean hopefully it does well uh um other than that I guess like I always say maybe leave a comment Please consider subscribing, maybe hitting that like button, and other than that, stay awesome, and even though they're starting to open stuff up, stay quarantined. See you guys later.